Larry Hockman, no more holding back.com, t3method.com. Just catching my breath. Just finished a hardcore, hard, hard, hardcore 20 minute workout. Cardiovascular, which may not seem like much. I don't know what your fitness level is. I don't know what your comfort level is with working out, but uh, inside baseball stuff. About five or six years ago, five years ago, I had a pretty serious, what I thought was serious, lower abdominal injury. And I got checked everything out. MRIs, CAT scans, the whole thing. Went to specialists. And after all of that, they found nothing. <laughs> they found a strain and they found anything. They didn't find anything that needed surgery. And so for me, cardio became a thing. I'm adjusting my camera as we go along here. I just threw it up there. Um, why am I telling you all this? So many of us are not doing the things we need to do because they are outside of our comfort zone. We know what will bring us to that next level that we fantasize about. We know what will bring us, and this is not just about exercise, this is about anything that brings us to that next place, detaching from a bad relationship to get to something better, whatever's on the next side. Detaching from a bad financial situation so that we can move to that next place. Um, learning the things we need to learn, and all different things. We don't want to look silly. We don't want to let ourselves be vulnerable in front of other people, in front of strangers, in front of loved ones, in front of ourselves. So I chose this moment, just coming down from workout, and yes, workouts are in my comfort zone. Maybe I'll need to do one with um, changing the oil on a car or changing tires or something that's way outside my comfort zone to get more to the point. What is it that you're holding yourself back from because you're afraid of what other people are going to think of you? Because you're afraid of stepping out of that place? There's nothing that's going to kill you. And if there is something that's going to kill you, you're smart enough to learn how to manage your risk. The only thing I'm saying is this. There is a whole big giant world, and you've heard it said many times, and here's one more way. Everything you want is right on the other side of your fear. And when you face your fear head on, with a sense of adventure, with a sense of play, you're going to find you're bigger than it is. Come visit me, nomoreholdingback.com, if you're feeling like a big, brave dog in a good way. T3method.com. I'll catch you later.